Boston, day two. We have infiltrated Reebok. My boy Bretzky left in, then he had to run to a meeting, so we're all just getting a little lift in, and then uh, I think we're gonna try to find, everybody's squatting, dude, like day, like day. And then we're gonna try to go to uh, Harpoon Breweries. The whole squad's here. This is rare footage. That looked great, dude. Then, uh, yeah, Bretzky has a meeting or two. Probably food, see what the day has to, to offer us. Uh, not sure how much adventuring we're gonna do at Reebok just because Brett's hella busy today, but another day we'll probably take a little tour of the HQ, try to show you guys around, but we're at the upstairs gym, so a bunch of cool stuff up here. It's a little bit more like, I guess, regular gym or commercial gym up here, and then they have like more strength and conditioning CrossFit gym downstairs. I'll try to show you guys that as well. Battery's dying. I'm gonna do some leg press, some lunges, maybe even cardio. We'll see. I'm here with the, uh, I'm here with the Chihuahua Pitbull mix. She's, she's, she, her attitude's out of a Chihuahua. But her, her other genetics are much of a pit bull. And so she's getting a bench on, so I'll lift off for her, leg press, figure the rest out. Workout, little leg press feel good. Stretch the groinage out, you know, gets a little tight, like a toiger when you're sitting around, sitting in planes and stuff. You get this area, you know what I'm saying? Gets a little tight, so some leg press, some lunges, a little bit of shoulders, just got a little move around, you know? When I'm, like I said, when I'm traveling, you can't really get it all done, but first time in my life, it's not happening. But first time in my life, I'm thinking, I've thought about living in different states or different cities. I love Sacramento, I'll probably never leave. Always have a house there, my mom's there. But places like LA have popped in my head, all my friends are down there, they always work. Mark's always telling me to go down there. Uh, Boston, I'm here a lot for work, I like it. I've been to Miami, I love Miami, it's a little bit more affordable. You start talking about taxes and when you work for yourself, you, you work in states like Texas or other places with less income tax. I'll save so much money if my businesses were out of there and housing so much cheaper. It's literally, literally excuse me, literally like 30% of the price, but just thoughts for now. No action's happening. We're gonna go to this little hipster spot, food. Gotta film a Q&A with you guys. Then uh, brewery tour. Not much of a drinker. I'm gonna see if I'm gonna hang. I feel like I'm hanging out with a bunch of drinkers that can really handle their booze. I'm just gonna strike it, stay composed. We'll talk to you. So we'll, we'll do, we'll, we'll do drunk. I didn't. I, look, I said, I said a bunch of drinkers. You brought out the A word. Who brought up the A word? We can start our own A club. No, dude. Now you're getting serious and sad. Dude. Like that's a real no, issue, dude. No, now you look bad. I can lead it. Oh, okay. I mean, I can, I can lead the session. Look, I never said that you're an alcoholic. I just said I'm with some drinkers, and I'm not a drinker. All right. All right. What are you doing, dude? You always ruin it every video. <laughs> That's what I'm good at. Look. What? You, I heard you're the beer connoisseur. The beer connoisseur. Where, yes. are, you, where are we going? Harpoon. And what do you know? Harpoon Brewery. I don't know a whole lot. Uh, what's the one that we're supposed to get? This this has oh, a sour. Raspberry. I saw it had a sour for you nerds. It has a sour? That's what I saw. We were told to try the raspberry tut, I think. It's, a, it's a wheat. Raspberry tut. tut. Look, it's like you, a tut. You want, me to, <laughs> you want me to take you to Java Juice instead? No. No. Let's just grab a real beer. Raspberry Tut? I mean, you drank pink lemonade last night. I know, I didn't want you, to. You, you loved it. it. I didn't say I loved it. It was a little sweet. It, it tasted you, like you, Jamba you Juice. It was bubbly. You drank multiple. Because I didn't want to go through the process of choosing. I'm very bad at making decisions. Okay, so I didn't well, want to go through the process. Wait, I just said. That's what I do though. I'll just, I just order you. I always yeah. find multiple things that I want. Uh, so then I just make you get what the other thing that I want. That's fine because I can't make decisions. You can flights at this brewery too. Well, I think that's oh, what the tour is supposed to be, right? Yeah, I'll flight it up, dude. Oh, do you get a flight on the tour? What do I know? I don't know. I just know that they have tours and they have beer. Yeah, and we're, we're running we're late. Going. We're running late. We just filmed the Q&A. We Dude, we're getting you to 5,000. <laughs> Bro. Big goals. We're just running on our own time. It's cool. Yeah. We're on nobody's itinerary this yeah. weekend but our own. But it closes at 6, so we're kind of on the a timeline. I mean, the tour closes at 6. We can still go to the brewery. Yeah, that's where Brett's meeting us. Right? Brett's meeting us there. Okay. At the... Uh, the, the he just wants to drink he beer. Want to he, he, wants, he just wants to drink beer. beer. He's, he's, skipping, just, he's skipping the foreplay. Bretsky, you son of a bitch. Factor in Germany. 
they put it together in pieces, sent it to us, and finished production. Uh, we weren't really sure how to put it together because the instructions were in German, so we had to hire a German engineer, but I think you did a pretty good job. The way this works is this cage right in front of me will bring those empty kegs up from the first floor. Being a two-floor system kind of sounds like unnecessary, right? Who? What? When, where, and why? When? Where and why? My name's Mike. We're my friends, you know? We did a brewery tour, never done a brewery tour. I, I do like beer, but I don't drink it that often. So now, we had a flight out there, probably like three out of the four. One was a little light for my taste. Came back here, we saw the process, we got a little chat. You see all the B-roll, this place is actually pretty dope. I've heard Harpoon has made it out west somehow, but uh, I don't think I've had their beer per se. So now we're in the tasting room. We jammed on a, a little stout deal, a little dark, a little chocolatey. Comment below the type of beer you like. The ladies like a sour, we didn't find one yet. We're gonna find one. We're gonna find a fucking sour. Me and Connor are more the IPA guys, somewhere in the middle, maybe an amber type deal. Um, but the coolest thing I think are these old classic cans. I don't know why, like art. I've talked about it in a different video, I think, but like I like to take different genres that I like from fashion to video to Instagram to um, accessories. I like hats, I like fanny packs, things like that, sneakers, right? Basketball, different cultures, hip hop. I like to translate the art from uh, genre to genre that doesn't necessarily belong. So like video game type things might influence how I talk or how I want to design a logo or something of that nature. So some of these cans are super dope. They're old school, multiple companies, but uh, whenever I travel places, I want to do shit that's local. And this is made here. This is uh, you know some college local kids made a brewery back in the day, and they've been here for a couple decades. So pretty dope to see. I think we're gonna go find Bretsky, find some food, but uh, for now. Temperatures, Jim. 